So is this a normal thing with her, or...? Mr. Stark. Uh, Mrs. Caretaker? Ma'am? I would appreciate you not making light of the situation. Aw, oh, that's kind of my thing. For the love of... But that's not what I was doing. <sighs> Go on. I understand the irony of an Avenger... Okay, of me personally saying this aloud, but this is no time for teammates to fight one another. What do you propose? A scapegoat. If magic needs to focus her anger on anyone, I can be... An asshole? Uh -huh. I was going to say myself turned up to 11, but that works. A gracious offer, but Ileana would never take the bait. Well, I can be some pretty obnoxious bait. Have you seen me crash award shows? You pale in comparison to the one she truly hates. And who is that? Her business to share. Thanks for doing this. Any questions, or are you ready to go? All right. Send me after magic. Okay. Here goes nothing. When blood is shed, let the staff of one emerge. Thanks for doing this. Any questions, or are you ready to go? Is this a one-way trip? It shouldn't be. Once you find magic, she can open a portal to send you back. Hopefully, both of you. What is the best way to approach magic? I feel like I'm the last person you should ask. I'm sure the others have some advice. I need a moment. I want to see what the others have to say. Find me when you're ready. And I'm in the business of granting wishes. Tell me, why does your heart ache? They forgot. Today is my... my... Oh, sweetly. Your birthday. What an awful way to learn what your family truly thinks of you. They don't love me. Nobody does. I can bring you to a magical kingdom. Make you its queen, loved by all in its domain. But you have to wish it so. I could never be as special as a queen. Now, now. That's a lie your family would tell you. I want to know you're a very special girl. Before we go, I have a question. Of course. Ask me anything, my queen. Are... are you a monster? Oh, child, I'm so much more than that. I'm a friend. The only one you'll ever need.
A house in limbo. What is this place? What are you doing here? It is not possible to enter Limbo without my knowing. How did you get here? Nico used the Staff of One. Of course. And why did she not come herself? She thought it would make things worse. Well, that makes two of us. Wait, if you found your way to this place, what did you hear? Well, I think I know why you hate your birthday. My deepest shame. You are the first beyond myself to know this. The first person, at least. The creature you heard brought me here. But my childish needs cursed me to this terrible place. I lost my childhood to one bad choice. I trusted a silver tongue instead of my own family. You cannot blame yourself. If not me, then who? I was a fool. You were a child. I was a foolish child. This day is an anniversary of my weakness. Nothing more. Who you were does not matter. It is who you become that counts. I would dismiss such words from anyone else. But you, of all people, would know this to be true. <sighs> I should stay here this evening. I can endure the stares and whispers, but not tonight. You could hang out here if you want. I... I would like that. Do you like the music? I do. Hmm. Good. Why do you ask? This was the only music I had for so long. I found it in Limbo. Trash, discarded by the universe. Is that normal? How can Trash get to Limbo? All forgotten things can find their way here. Even music, and the means to play it. Even now, I only listen at meaningful times, when I wish to remember the moment. There are more of those now, but not enough to outweigh the days I want to forget. Hunter, can we stay here for a time? Listen to the music? Of course. <laughs> Good. Smiling, I am pleasantly surprised.
Could you tell me about the creature you mentioned? Something I hope you never have the misfortune to meet. I can't say no more. Why not? It hears when you speak its name. I refuse to give it this satisfaction. What happened to it? An eviction of sorts. A permanent one? That is my hope. Why does this look like your room in the Abbey? It doesn't. My room in the Abbey looks like this one. For years, this was the only place in Limbo where I was safe. Where I felt at home. The creature said many strange things about you. How much was true? None. All were lies to manipulate a stupid child. The creature brought me here to rule this place, but not as I do now. It desired a servant. Loyal, unthinking. A stupid child who believed its lies. I took great pleasure in disappointing it. I should get going. I will open a portal for you. Good night, Magic. See you, Hunter. I should get going. See you, Hunter. I am growing to like you, Hunter. gone for so long. Did you find magic? I did. She is going to spend the night in limbo. Is she doing all right? Is she mad at me? She is fine. We had a lot of fun. You did? Yeah, we listened to music. In limbo. Achievement unlocked, I guess. At least her birthday ended on a high note. That's all that matters. I can't thank you enough for doing this. Don't know how this would have ended without you. Good night, Hunter. Good night, Nico. There is my ferocious Charlie girl. Sorry, dear. 
Hope I didn't startle you. Hunter, you saw her, didn't you? Wanda. What does she want? What we all want. To be found. But Sarah does not want to find her. I will always love Sarah. Even her stubbornness, even her rigidity, even when she's wrong. And she is wrong this time. She still blames Wanda for my death. How do I convince her Wanda is still out there? You can't. Sarah won't believe it until she sees Wanda with her own eyes. I know you didn't know Wanda, but I did. She's family, Hunter. We cannot leave her behind. Besides, we can't win this battle against your mother without her. So find her, Hunter. Bring her back. For all our sakes. What are you doing here, Hunter? You need to find the Midnight Suns and save Wanda. And you need to do it now. Have you seen any of the Midnight Suns? I need to speak to them. I think I overheard Blade talking about how he was going to the chapel, which is... weird. I didn't think vampires could go into churches or chapels or whatever. See what I know about the supernatural. Hope he doesn't think Carol is gonna meet him there. Thank you, Peter. No problemo. Hope you find them. of sorts. That is what Agatha used to say anyway. What sort? The dark sort? A discernment spell. Well, more of a tracking ritual, like a seance. And no, it's not dark. I got it right from the source. I'll put it back before Caretaker even knows it's missing. Hey man, we gotta try something. I mean, it has to be a sign, right? And all four of us had the same dream of Wanda? Make that five. You win. Ouija away, or whatever. Lock the door. Remember, once we start, we don't stop. Keep your mind focused on Wanda. Ego, spiritus, add. Got it. What did I just say? Do not break the connection. Okay, uh, sorry. Right. <sighs> this is how Atlantis sank. Ego, spiritus, ad me. Ego, spiritus, ad me. Ego, spiritus, ad me. Ego spiritus at me. Ego spiritus at me. Ego spiritus at me. Ego spiritus at me. Ego spiritus Whoa! Anyone else see that? She said not to break the connection. Well, you just did. Ego spiritus at me. Ego spiritus at me. Ego spiritus at me. Was that our fault? I think so. Disconnect! Pull the plug or something! It's too late. As they, ego
zone in their showers when we get home. If we get home. There's no telling where that screwed up spell sent us. This could be a broom closet in the basement of Dr. Doom's castle for all we know. Or a storage nook on Galactus' world ship. Holding pen on a scroll cruiser. Oh, maybe the inside of Robbie's brain. There. Something powerful. Something strong. Something foul. That's where we begin. Of course you were gonna say that. It's your strength. As they 
they say, it gets the job done. This is the last group I would expect. I suppose there was a high probability that the hunter would be drawn to this location. But you two? What were your names again? Nancy and Margaret? Okay, now he's just messing with us. This usually works. Be careful where you wave your staff, or swords, or whatever other enchanted LARPing weapons you brought into my facility. The modifications I've made to the Gamma Accelerator have rendered it quite volatile. I wouldn't want you to get hurt. The Mind Probe is far less reliable when the brain is damaged. Tony Stark was right. You are moving. Centuries ago. came about. Far too amateurish an operation for Carol, or even Tony. It's not the how I should be focusing on, but the why. You're not here for the Gamma Accelerator at all, are you? No. The truth is far more delightful. Of course it is. Well, by all means, then, have at it. It wouldn't surprise me if Thanos himself walked out of that thing. Wanda! No. Oh, Wanda. We were too late. She belongs to Lilith now. Death is her only chance for release. What? Hell no! No, that's not how we work. Haven't you learned anything yet? Leave her alone, you monster! Oh, I assure you, Miss Maximoff is free to do as she pleases. She appears neither free nor pleased to me. Really? Wanda, is there something you'd like to say to your friend?
hesitate, friends. I won't. I've heard a great deal of the- It's all starting to make sense. Tony must have known that I would need her energies to help stabilize the reaction. Perhaps he thought her connection to the two of you would somehow prevent the inevitable slaughter about to occur. Or perhaps you're simply his canaries in the coal mine. In either case, I may have underestimated him. Uh, you sure you're all right there, Brucey? Sounding a little unhinged. He is starting to rant like Faustus. Gloves are off. Shouldn't have come here. It seems they have brought more friends. And spinning. It's like a trade. Coming here was a mistake. on your faces. Genuine astonishment. Just like before with Tony and Steve at the tower. I wonder, have we heroes always been so trusting, so gullible? There is no we anymore, traitor. You forfeited that right when you became another of my mother's puppets. Trying to save Wanda. I suppose I should add illogical to the list.
The light will carry you on. Spotted enemy reinforcements. We have to stop letting Banner get to us. Remember why we're here. Wanda, snap out of it. We don't want to hurt you. You cannot hurt me. The mother will never let anyone hurt me. Ever again. More of Lilith's lies. I have heard such words repeated far too many times. for Hydra.
would you do that to a friend? Do not fear the mother's embrace. Let her warmth envelop you. Comfort you. Make you whole. There is nothing left in her eyes. Such peace. Such a harmony of energies flowing through one form. She really is something, isn't she? I always believed the Scarlet Witch was powerful, but through Lilith, Wanda Maximoff has become transcendent. Shut up, both of you! Well, this encounter has certainly smashed my expectations. <laughs> Come now, Bruce. Can't let yourself get too carried away. We were planning on taking them alive. Then again, Wanda. Eliminate them. This is over. We must leave now. What? It's me. It is not her, Nico. She cannot hear you anymore. Did I see her almost destroy all three of us? Then yes. She hesitated, and then blew up the ground where you were standing. Still, one is in there. Somewhere. I know it. No. She is here. Impossible. Close it! Now! I am trying to do! No escape. No more. You were saying, Wanda. You. Your fault. You will be no more. Enough! Not Agatha. Don't say a word, Nico. What would be the point? The caretaker doesn't understand that sitting around doing nothing affords Lilith more time. Rules are like hearts. Break them, and get ready for the fireworks. Nico, I... Don't bother. Kinda just want to be left alone. At least we tried. Save it for a speech. I'm tired. 
We can talk tomorrow, when you are feeling better. Yeah, right. Might be a while. I will be here. But Wanda won't. Ileana, are you okay? My best friend just tried to murder me. What do you think? Maybe we should consider Wanda is too dangerous to save. How dare you? I am sorry. I just... Leave. Before I say something I will regret. I have too many regrets this evening already. Good night, then. Good? There is nothing good about this night, Hunter. Nothing good at all. Why, hello, Hunter. Hunter, if you're looking for caretaker, she went to her room. Yeah, and she uh made it very clear she doesn't want to be disturbed. She's uh pretty upset. We really screwed up, didn't we? I knew we shouldn't have gone messing with that mirror. I'm worried about Nico and Magic. I think they're in shock or something. We're all in shock. It's gonna take some time for us to pull it back together. If we manage to pull ourselves together at all. I'm very, very intimidated by Caretaker. She pushed Wanda right out of the Abbey. Again. Hmm. Hey, Charlie Warley puppy face. Rattled, aren't they? It seems there's a competition going on to see who can reprimand the young sons the harshest. Are you participating? I'm really glad everyone made it back safe and sound, which is impressive on its own. Trying an incantation like that at their level. <laughs> One might think they would ask for a Sorcerer Supreme's guiding hand. I am sure that they now know it would have been better with you there. Kind of you, Hunter. I kept my composure, but I care for Wanda. It was under my watch that she was taken. There is nothing more I want than to make this right. Even if the outcome wasn't as hoped, we now know what has happened to her. I've been hearing her voice, but each time it grows fainter. By the great Agamotto, we'll bring her back to us. And here I thought we were finally starting to trust each other. They went behind our backs. Nearly cost us everything. They were trying to save their friend, like any of us would do. Please, I would never do anything that reckless. Do you even hear the words coming out of your mouth anymore? I would never do anything that reckless, given the stakes. Really? Okay, fine. I would never do anything that reckless today. I give that a solid maybe. Whew. You look like hell, dear. 
I suppose you must feel like it too after these very rough few days. I am not worried about me. I am more concerned with how everyone else is faring. Not well, obviously. I am sorry you were unable to save Wanda, but at least you tried. I can't help but feel responsible for how things played out. Perhaps I pushed you too hard to save her too soon, before you, Nico, and Magic were ready. What happened was not your responsibility. We chose to betray Sarah's trust and put the lives of everyone here in jeopardy. You did not make us. Yes. But if it wasn't for me emboldening you, we may have avoided this whole mess. I cannot get Wanda out of my head now. Seeing her like that... I know I did not know her before she fell, but she was in so much pain. It permeated from her. I could feel it tear right through me. I just wish I could have freed her from it. I know, dear. Me too. Maybe you'll get a chance to again. In the meantime, don't beat yourself up about it too much. And remember how much Sarah and I love you. Hola. When you do immature things, you get called immature. <laughs> 